Hi everybody, it's Nani. How you doing today? I am great. I am back with a Dollar Tree haul and this is a good one. It is awesome finds, fun stuff. I am so, so happy with this haul. And as always, I'm going to start with what I showed in my thumbnail. I found a bunch of this hair food. It's hair products, shampoos, conditioners. I thought this was an amazing find. I know I have seen these products in the big name stores. Never thought I would see these in the Dollar Tree. This is the Hair Food Curl Define Shampoo in Mango and Aloe, a 10.1 ounce. They are sulfate free, paraben free, silicone free, cruelty free. And on the back, it gives you all the ingredients and what they do, why they do it, and it says our mission is simple feed your hair like you feed your body each collection is crafted to cleanse and nourish your hair without sulfated cleansers parabens dyes or mineral oil we believe peace of mind comes from knowing what's in the product you use that is amazing and the bottle is made with 100 percent recycled plastic i think that is great it is also made in the usa of US or imported products, and it is distributed by Procter & Gamble. This is amazing. And I'm assuming the information is the same on all of these, so I'm not gonna read it all again, but this was the Curl & Define Shampoo. This is the Color Protect Conditioner in White Nectar and Pear. This one is the Smooth Conditioner in Avocado and Argon Oil, but I couldn't find matches to any of them. Like I couldn't find the match to the Curl and Define. I couldn't find the match for the Color Protect. So I'm gonna take a picture of, of all these things and when we go back to the store, I'm gonna try to find matches for them, which it doesn't matter to me if there's matches or not. I will use them no matter what. But guys, these are this is an incredible buy. And the scent, it is amazing. This mango aloe, oh, the white nectarine and pear. Oh, that one is just so clean. And then the avocado and argon oil. They all just smell so nice. This made me super happy. And I know this was way more than $1.25 in the other stores. And then this was the other hair food item that I found. And this is called Hair, Skin and Nails Vitamins. It says fermented biotin and superfood herbs. You get 30 capsules in here. It's a dietary supplement. And it says one capsule daily with food, not recommended for children. And it deeply nourishes hair, nails, with 1,000% daily value of probiotic fermented biotin to support your natural production of keratin. I think that is amazing. I don't know anything about this product itself. I have never seen this before. I've never tried it before, but I do take biotin daily. And the expiration date on this, and it is an expiration date, not a best buy, it's an expiration date, is December of 23. So I think that is great. I do see non-GMO. A lot of these print, the print here is so small, it's hard for me to read it even with glasses on but I think that is incredible. I'm gonna go ahead and open this because I'll be the one taking this. It comes in, and, is that glass or plastic? That's glass. It comes in a glass bottle. Do I wanna open it? Yeah, I'll open it. I wanna see what they look like. They're kind of a, um, they almost look like cinnamon. They smell like grass like dried grass, but I think that is amazing. This made me happy. So now I'm on the lookout for all the other 
matches to the shampoos and conditioners because I think that is great. The scent of these guys, oh, it's so, so nice. So let me know if you guys have seen any of the matches to those in your stores. So if you see them, if you have tried them, let me know your thoughts. Do I have any food items this time? Just one. They have these. These are the Columb Columbina brand. These are the Club Crackers, and you get six on-the-go packs. No added colors or flavors. The best buy is February of 24, so that'll get you through the holiday season if you make cracker trays for whatever, Halloween, Thanksgiving, Christmas, 4th of July, whatever it may be. These are great, and I wanna try one. I love crackers. Crackers are sometimes my go-to snack. I love them. Nice size, individually wrapped packages. What did it say? How many crackers were in each one? Did it say that? I know I read it somewhere. There's four crackers. Wow, they're big. They are big crackers, guys. They're like a graham cracker size. These are big crackers. They are um like perforated that you can break them into three in each one. Let's see how messy they are. Mm. Mm hmm. They're super fresh, super flaky. Those are good. I will be picking up more of these if I see them. These are good. Mm-hmm. Get these if you like crackers. Those are good, guys. I love this kind of very simple, very simple cracker. They're very lightly salted. Those, these are good. Highly recommend. Okay, now I need to take a drink. Don't mind my straw. There's lipstick on it. That's good. All right, which way do I go here? Picked up for the littlest grand lady. I don't know if I'll get this out now or put this in her Christmas bin. These are the um the tablets with the lines to learn how to write. I want to start doing that with her whenever she comes to visit. And when I saw it, I went ahead and picked one up because I don't notice these in the store that often. And what does it say on here? It says manuscript tablet, and it also has the writing guide. They're made in the USA, Treehouse Kids Learn and Create brand, and you get 40 sheets in here. So I went ahead and picked up one. Where's the guide? Oh, I see it. It's right here on the front page. So I think this would be awesome just to start teaching her, you know, how to control the crayon or the pencil, the marker, how to start drawing, you know, nice straight lines, curved lines, keeping within the lines. So we're going to start working on that. And then the gift that I'm making with all art supplies, I saw these and thought this was really different. It's a stretched canvas and it's stretched around the wooden frame and it's a unicorn. So the little one that I'm making the gift for, for, she can go ahead and paint, use the wooden easel that we got for her, and go ahead and paint the pretty unicorn. And they had other prints as well, and I honestly can't remember. I'm thinking maybe one of them was a koala bear. I can't remember what the other ones were. And to go along with that, I got her some little paints like this. I just figured these kind of paints would be a lot neater for her to use instead of the big tubes of paint. So that's why I stuck with the smaller packaging. You get six colors, crafter square, brush included, and it just says paint. Really pretty colors. A really, like a dark navy, I guess cobalt kind of color, a turquoise, green, yellow, orange, pink. So I thought that would go really nice with the unicorn, bright unicorn colors. And then I already picked her up a actual sketch pad but I thought this would be fun for her. It's a um, 
tear off palette and you get 15 sheets in here by crafters square and they're kind of shaped like the state of pennsylvania but you can just paint on it doodle on it and then they tear out they almost feel kind of waxed and i don't know if you can see that it is kind of shiny so this is just gonna go in the in her little bag gift bag I'm getting quite the collection of stuff for in that, so that makes me happy. I think I'm actually pretty close to being done for in that <clears throat> in that gift. And then fun stuff, guys. And you guys didn't tell me these things were out there. They're called waggles. Waggles. They're little animals with all the little tchotchkes to go with it. This guy, who is he? His name is Good and Fed, and he looks like he is a hippo. It's going to be very hard to show it through the packaging, but he comes with all of his all of his food. He's Good and Fed. He has French fries. It looks like this is a chef's hat, so he must be a chef. There's an ice cream cone. There's a little booklet of stickers. He has a little pink tail. So he is a hippo named Good and Fed. This guy looks like maybe an owl, and his name is Whiskers Off, and he looks very wise. He has a white cape, he has a pair of sunglasses, and he has a cane right here, and it looks like a, like a stick, like a walking stick. So his name is Whiskers Off. This guy, his name is loving you it's a you it's a sheep I could, maybe it's a girl I'm not quite sure what if it's a boy or a girl it also comes with stickers and sunglasses and a scarf and then the last one that I found is a pig and his name is smile and oink and he is riding a skateboard and he has glasses and a baseball cap, also stickers. So I found those four and I'm still on the lookout for the donkey and the penguin. And the donkey's name is Hoofenschmeels and the penguin's name is Coldenschlepp. So I thought those were so cute what a nice gift but it gets better hold on so there's two more of these that i'm on the lookout for to go with these guys or girls i'm not quite sure what they are they have all the fun playground accessories and this one is by waggles and this is the seesaw you get six pieces and it says easy assembly stickers included so this is the seesaw for the little little guys. They also had the swing set, the friendship swing, and there's 11 pieces. It also says it's easy to assemble, stickers included. And then, and these were the only three items I found, and apparently that's all because it shows the three on the back. So I'm assuming that is all of them. This is 12 pieces, and this is the very merry-go-round. That's the merry-go-round. 12 pieces, easy assembly, stickers included. So I think I got all three sets. I don't, I don't see anything different on the backs of these that there would be another set. So I think this is great. I think I'm going to put these away as a gift for somebody for Christmas. So I'm still on the lookout for the other two characters. I think that is so cool. Excellent. You just never know what you're going to find at the Dollar Tree. And I think that is so fun. And if I decide not to give it as a gift to someone I know, some child... Toys for Tots is going to absolutely love that. And then I found myself a couple more of the Chapstick Lip Balm products. This one, they're two different things. The packaging looks very similar, 
but you can see they're very different. This one is the Chapstick Total Hydration, which I love. I think I have a new one in here. I'm not done with the one I'm using right now. I have this one as backup. This is the um, Chapstick Total Hydration with the Rosemary and Mint Peppermint. These are the Total Hydration with Sea Minerals. So I'm gonna go ahead and open this because these are for me. I am loving these Chapstick products. Let me see if I can get it out easily. Pretty packaging. Very, very light scent. Nothing overpowering, that's for sure. So if you guys have tried that, let me know. And it says, use uses the restorative powers of the sea to nourish lips. Reduces the appearance, appearance of fine lines and wrinkles. Man, I need that. Keeps the lips looking smoother, healthier, and more youthful. Paraben and phthalate free, not tested on animals. So this is kind of like the, the balm. And then this looks like it's a tube with the same information on it. So let's see what this one looks like. I've never had one like this before. Yes, this is just like a little squeeze tube. It has the um, angled, angled tip that you would push it out. I'm afraid to squeeze too hard. I don't want a bunch to come out. It's a, it's a clear gel is what you probably can't see that, but it's like a clear gel. So I'm really curious to try this, not, not smelling anything with this either. And this says it is an overnight lip renewal treatment. All right. That's awesome. So I'm going to go ahead and set this beside my bed and try that. I just noticed that just now. This is the Nourishing Lip Balm. And up here on the top, it says overnight lip renewal treatment. Excellent. I'm really liking the chapstick products that they're coming out with in the DT right now. They're, they're amazing. And I'm telling you, this one, this has been a favorite and I can't find them in the store anymore. I keep looking because I love it so much, but I cannot find it. All right, everybody, that is it for this haul. I found some good stuff. This haul just makes me happy. This smells so good. And this one, which one was it? It's this one. This mango and aloe. Oh my goodness. The scent of this. It is just summertime in a bottle. That is nice. Not coconut or anything like that. It's not it's not like um like suntan lotion smell. This is just it is mango. It is bright and fresh and makes me happy. So one of each of those is going to go in the shower because I want to try them tonight. All right, everyone, I'm going to go ahead. I'm going to get off of here and get this stuff put away. And you may see me in the same outfit because I have part two of my Timu haul that I need to get done. I'm hoping to get it up for you guys for tomorrow, which should be Thursday. Let me look at my, it, yeah, it should be it should be Thursday, tomorrow, that it comes out, but I, I need to get it done. So I may jump right into that next. All right, everyone. If you like this type of thing, please subscribe. I'd love to have you as part of my YouTube family. You guys are the best. Have a great day, everybody, and I'll talk to you again here really soon. Peace.